video review. This and a lot of people have recently started getting these guys, and I wanted to get this out as soon as possible to try to help people as much as possible with their transformation. So, getting on to it, because we don't have too much time, and this guy takes a long time to transform. First, as you can see, he is in the same scheme as the original Peter built semi truck. Some differences here that you already see in the front. I, I kind of like the grill on this a little bit more. It, it's a little bit nicer. I don't quite like how the Autobot symbol, the Autobot symbol on the new one is like straight red. And there's no, it, it's so hard to see it. It's molded in the Autobot symbol, but it's just a straight red paint put onto it. I like this one a little bit more. I also like the fact that he's got the blue translucent headlights a little bit more than the clear ones. I know this is a little bit more realistic, but that just kind of looks a little bit nicer, I guess. Noticeable Autobot symbol here as opposed to here. One thing that you'll notice is that the wheel well on the original one is vastly bigger than the one on the new Revenge of the Fallen. The blue coloring that you see on the old guy is a lot darker than the lighter one. I kind of like the dark coloring a little bit more. Of course, I'm just being nitpicky on a lot of this stuff, so bear with me. The, the side step, you can see this one is just straight gray with no painting or anything on it, but this is painted. Of course, the gas tank is not quite as big as this one because this one houses the batteries. Back section, first, looks a little bit better. Now, it's closed off a lot better on the Revenge of the Fallen guy than this one. But I also like the fact that there's translucent bits on the rear lights as opposed to the original version. So it's a little bit different. Plus the, the red is a little bit darker than this one. You might be able to tell that on the camera. I'm not 100% sure. So other than that though, th this, these, this is a very nice kind of copy of this one. I mean, both of these are nice. This guy's gonna stay in vehicle mode. This one's gonna be in robot mode because this one is just much more accurate to the CGI model. So on the back, you got two little nubs. This one doesn't do anything. This one, when you push it, he makes this sound. And you can kind of see the light inside there. I got so right, right in there. And if you hold it down, it just continuously keeps going and going and going. So now to go ahead and transform, first what you want to do here, come around to the side, kind of grab here and grab this top section. And you want to lift this up. Do that on the same side. Now, re remember folks, I transform things the way that's easiest for me, not necessarily the way the instructions tell you to. So if it works, great. If not, transform something else. Separate this section from the blue.